Hi, my name is Effie Evanyardis and I am the Associate Director of Student Engagement at Melbourne Institute of Technology. At MIT we use a holistic approach of student engagement centred around the four pillars of learning, enrichment, representation and consultation. The first pillar of successful learning centres around students being active participants in their learning journey. At MIT we run face-to-face -face classes but they are not your traditional old school chalk and talk classes. They're basically interactive classes. For an example, for one of the units we're actually teaching within the diploma course this trimester, we're using an interactive resource. Now that's not a traditional textbook, it's actually an interactive book. That is embedded within the student's Moodle shell, which is their learning platform. And as students are doing their week-to-week -week classes and activities, they're actually doing the interactive exercises within their class. At MIT we strive to assist students with being more than good learners. We do this through our co-curricular and extracurricular activities. One of this year's extracurricular activities is our spring ball which we're actually running a spring balls both at the Melbourne and Sydney campus. Now the spring balls are basically an idea that the students came up with themselves, therefore the students are actually running the spring ball. The seven students that are on the spring ball committee are enhancing their teamwork, their global awareness, and these attributes are part of MIT's graduate skills attributes. The third of the fourth pillars is meaningful collaboration. Now what this means is that MIT uses quality assurance framework for continuous improvement mechanisms. We are always trying to improve the service we offer the students. At MIT we place a lot of importance on student feedback. This includes student advocacy. Student advocacy is basically assisting the students with representation. Our fourth and final pillar is participative representation. The aim of participative representation is to improve teaching and learning with a feedback loop to update students on the actions taken. In essence, student engagement is in our DNA. It's, it's within our culture. It's at the heart of everything we do. At the end of the day, what I and every single member of staff strive for is to see the students graduate. Having them undertake their course, pass their subjects and graduate and from there, start their professional life.